Hi everyone, let's continue bibliometric analysis. In this bibliometric analysis, I'm going to share with you one very important paper that is reflecting difference between SiteNet Explorer and Vosphere. This is also both these softwares are the uh, softwares using for bibliometric analysis. This paper has been published in Scientiometrics in 2017 and uh, written by Nisjen and Ludo. Here is, you can see, received this paper on 6 June 2016, published online 27 February 2017. And this paper is an open access paper in the Stringer link. So you can download easily, but I would also give the link in my description box for this particular paper. So clustering scientific, this one is the software tools, two software tools, SiteNet Explorer and Voss Viewer has been used for cluster publication and to analyze the result clustering solution. These papers are based on this. And SiteNet Explorer is used to cluster a large set of publication in the field of astronomy and astrophysics. The publications are clusters based on direct citation relations. So SiteNet Explorer and Bosphere are used together to analyze the resulting clustering solution. So in this paper, actually, I mean, we can also use both these softwares uh, for clustering solutions together. So both tools use visualization to support and analyze of the clustering solutions with SiteNet Explorer focusing on analysis at the level of individual publication and Vosphere. Yes, this is the most important difference. What could be the utility of SiteNet Explorer? and Vosviewer. SiteNet Explorer focusing on the analysis at the level of individual publications, but Vosviewer focusing on the analysis at an aggregate level. So this is the difference between these two softwares. Now we come to the, so we come to the, what has written in the introduction part, introduction part that is giving well explained about the bibliometric analysis and bibliometric analysis, what are the uh, utility of this bibliometric analysis? And uh, further we can go for, this one is Cytoscore and Boss Viewer. You can see, demonstrate two softwares in this paper. And both these papers, SiteNet Explorer and Boss Viewer can be used to cluster publication and to analyze the resulting cluster solutions and uh, here is you can see SiteNet Explorer which is abbreviation of what is the full form of SiteNet Explorer Citation Network Explorer is a software tool that we have developed for its analyzing and visualizing citation network in the approach that we take in this paper we first use SiteNet Explorer to cluster publications and further the same author has been taken was viewer. So first of all, we would understand to facilitate the analysis of clustering solutions, the following features of the site net explorers are essential. Number one, visualization, visualizing a citation network, right? And further, it is drilling down into a citation network. Drilling down means uh, what happened, SiteNet Explorer can be used to analyze a clustering solution at different levels of details. So drilling down into one or more selected clusters. That is in the within the same cluster you are going in depth. Next one is searching for publications. So through uh, SiteNet Explorer, that can be used to find publications that are of special interest, for instance, like all publication in a specific journal. So this kind of research, we can do it. But Vosphere is a software tool that is constructing and visualizing bibliometric network. So uh, further is, there is, we can see, this paper is organized like clustering technique section that discuss the clustering technique that is used by SiteNet Explorer to cluster publications and their related citation and result section that demo demonstrate SiteNet Explorer and Vosphere to cluster publication, right? So SiteNet Explorer is used to cluster more than you can say. 
वन लैक पब्लिकेशन इन दील्ड ऑफ एस्ट्रोनॉमी एंड एस्ट्रोफिजिक्स एंड साइट नेट एक्सप्लोर एंड वॉस्टवेयर आर यूज टूगेदर टू एनालाइज दी रिजल्टिंग क्लस्टरिंग सोल्यूशन सो इन दिस पार्ट यू कैन सी दिस वन इज दज वेल डिफाइंड एज आई सेट क्लस्टरिंग टेक्निक एंड फर्दर इट इज हाउ वी कैन यूज how what could be the correct um, uh, correct uh, we can say uh, process to use both these softwares so we can see further this one is the clustering publication this had is well defined under this heading you can see what could be the clustering techniques maximizing the quality fractions and uh, further we can go to the results as i said earlier also so demonstrate how site net explorer and wasware can be used to cluster publication to analyze resulting clustering solutions and further is we can talk about data what data they have used astro data set that is used and further is this is the number one table statistics for the data set of astronomy and astrophysics publication you can see what is the number total number of journal cited references each and everything has been given and further is using site net explorer to cluster publications so cluster publications also what are the parameters minimum cluster size number of clusters how many clusters they had made 22 clusters and uh, all these information is uh, given over here in the table 2 and further is brief summary of the 22 level one cluster because total 22 clusters has been created and uh, further is using site net explorer to analyze clustering solutions at the publication level so when we will talk about at the publication level so this would be the like output so site net this this diagram this particular diagram has been created through site net explorer not by boss view so visualization of 100 most frequently cited publication in the level 1 and 1 2 3 and 4 colors indicate the level 1 cluster to which the publication belongs which cluster right it, it it is they are falling in the one cluster i mean these are the color wise segregation and further is we can come to the next diagram also yeah this one is the figure 2 site site net explorer visualization of 100 most frequently cited publication level 1 cluster 2 colors indicating and all you can see these are the clusters and further through wasware because wasware is doing not at the individual level that is doing at the aggregate level because um, this is the difference between wasware and site score so further is we can see this one is the network diagram has been created by wasware so wasware visualization and uh, further is one more diagram through wasware so wasware it is reflecting the map visualization for level 1 and cluster 3 that shows 1420 terms extracted from the title and abstracts of the publication belonging to this cluster and color wise segregation and finally yes uh, what is the conclusion we have demonstrated the use of site net explorer and was viewer for clustering publications based on direct citation relation and for analyzing the resulting clustering solution and site net explorer focusing on visualization at the level of individual publication and was we are focusing on visualization at an aggregate level this is the uh, most important difference and uh, here is you can find it um this one is the both these things they have used we have demonstrated you can see author has written this particular statement um we have demonstrated the capabilities of site net explorer and was viewer for clustering publication for analyzing the result clustering solutions and actually what we are doing we are doing the same thing with the help of the site net explorer and was viewer and uh, i think uh, mm, this one is the that's all and uh, further is i would uh, i had already created a video on site net explorer how we can conduct analysis through site net explorer as well as through was viewer also so i will give you link of both these uh, videos in my description box so if suppose somebody would like to do research using these two softwares you can do that and you can first watch this video 
then you can prepare your research article on the basis of these two softwares that is SiteNet Explorer and Vosphere. So I hope this video would be helpful to you. So stay tuned. Keep watching.